It's been a chilly and foggy Thursday throughout the Sunrise side. Thank you for tuning in to your Thursday evening weathercast. Temperatures, though, feeling not like July, more like October or even April. 59 degrees in Rogers City, 62 in Alpena, and then warming up a bit more so towards the south at 69 in West Branch, 68 in Tawas. But that humidity, unfortunately, for the ladies is bringing a bad frizzy hair day 96 percent in alpina 97 in roger city 93 in oscota a bit of dry air as you make your way down state 69 percent in flint 64 in lansing and that's where the hair issues are not so much a factor but because of the humidity being so high where we are that's also introducing that fog make sure to drive with those low beams throughout the late afternoon pushing into the evening especially with that visibility down to two miles in alpina seven in oscota improving as you make your way towards the west at 10 in pelston 10 in grand rapids now when it comes to the cloud cover as we push through the next couple of hours it's still going to remain temperatures are not going to move too much maybe drop maybe just a couple maybe two to three degrees at best by the time we wake up tomorrow morning it really won't be until friday as we continue to see more of that breakdown of the clouds as this front system begins to slowly try to get out of the Great Lakes and that's going to allow for some sunshine to sneak in. We could be dealing with a couple scattered showers still for the overnight and maybe early tomorrow morning, but look at those clouds beginning to break down. That's going to allow for the sun to come in and also temperatures are going to begin to warm up back into those 70s. Pushing into Saturday, however, we're going to continue to see more of that warmth and it's going to be beautiful out there. So make sure to bring back the sunglasses and that sunscreen on Saturday. Also that water bottle as we get back into those 80s. So summer will be back. We're also going to be dealing with a small chance of some showers and thunderstorms on Saturday night. Sunday, we'll see a bit of a cool down when it comes to those readings back into those 70s with just overall with partly cloudy skies and maybe in some areas even sunnier skies, but it's looking to be at least a decent start to the work week. Hour by hour for tonight though, it's just gonna be a dreary one with some scattered showers, hit and miss, temperatures only dropping towards 59 or 60 degrees by Friday morning. And then those rain chances gradually falling towards zero by tomorrow night and those clouds begin to stubbornly exit the sunrise side, allowing for some sun to finally sneak in after three long days. When it comes to beach and boating tomorrow, it's going to be a cloudy one. Winds out of the north at 5 to 10 knots. Waves at less than 2 feet for both days. Saturday is looking to be a better one as we have mostly sunny skies and temperatures topping out in those low 80s. Water temperatures on the milder side at 64 degrees. And through the next seven days, warming up from those 80, from those low 70s on Sunday all the way into the low 80s by Tuesday with a good amount of sunshine.